Hey everyone, what's up and welcome back, it's Zach. In today's video, I'm gonna be doing a review of this Aveeno Common Restore Nourishing Oat Cleanser. I've already done a review of the serum and the moisturizer from this line, so now it's time to finish it off with the cleanser. If that sounds good to you, please hit that subscribe button and give my video a thumbs up. I am doing a massive giveaway when I reach a thousand subscribers. So definitely subscribe so that you can join in on that. All right, so a little bit of claims about this Aveeno cleanser. This retails for $8.99 in my local drugstore. It is a fragrance-free, gentle cleanser that hydrates to preserve the skin's moisture barrier. And it also says that this milky cleanser lifts away dirt and impurities, leaving the skin looking healthy and hydrated. It is fragrance-free, sulfate-free, paraben-free, alcohol-free, dye-free, and tested on sensitive skin. So that all sounds really nice. One thing I'll say about this, and it doesn't claim it, but this is definitely not gonna be good on your own. You definitely need a first step cleanser. This is not gonna remove makeup or water resistant sunscreen or tinted sunscreen. But they don't claim to do that, so no worries. I've been using this at night. I start with a first step cleanser, either a balm or an oil to take off all my sunscreen. And then I will go in with this cleanser. It goes on very milky, very creamy. It reminds me a lot of the CeraVe hydrating cleanser, except that this has that oat in it. This feels really nice on the skin and I think it is really hydrating, but I find that it doesn't really do a whole lot for my skin. And so this is really best suited for people that have really dry skin or really sensitive skin. This isn't going to treat acne. This isn't going to treat rosacea or dark spots or anything like that. This is just simply to gently cleanse the skin. If you're somebody that has sensitive or dry skin, this could also be great to use in the morning just to kind of quickly cleanse and hydrate the skin, get off maybe that oil throughout the night or you know bacteria from your pillows or your sheets or stuff like that while not stripping the skin. So I definitely can see this being good for use. I've used I've used about half of this and I do continue to reach for it every single night. So that is definitely a good sign. Another great thing about this is that this is a recyclable bottle. So you can just take off the, the pump, throw this away and then rinse this out and you can recycle this bottle. So that's awesome. I love that these big corporations are getting into using more eco-friendly, sustainable options. I love that. If you didn't know, Avino is owned by Johnson & Johnson, who also owns Neutrogena. And Neutrogena has almost an identical line to this, except it's called their Hydro Boost. So they have their Hydro Boost cleanser, gel moisturizer, and serum. And Avino now has the same thing, but Avino does have that oat in it and the Neutrogena does hyaluronic acid. So depending on what you're looking for, you can kind of steer to each of those. They're the same price, same package, everything else is the same. So would I recommend you to go out and buy this? Yeah, my skin type is combination and acne prone, but I'm able to make this work in my routine. I never use this in the morning personally because in the morning I like something that's going to clean my skin a little bit better. That way I don't get overly oily throughout the day. But I, don't, I definitely like this at night. I just go in, right now I'm using the Inky List Oat Cleansing Balm, and then I go in with this, and the combination has been really, really nice. That's all I have for this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed. It is a little bit of a shorter video, but there's not a whole lot to say about a face wash. But if you do wanna see my thoughts on that serum or moisturizer from the Avino Common Restore line, definitely check that out on my channel. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe because again, I am doing a massive giveaway when I reach 1,000 subscribers. I'm giving away over $200 worth of skincare, so definitely want to be subscribed so you don't miss out on that. Hope you guys have a great day and I appreciate your time.